What's up guys, it's Rob aka Big Ben. This is the first time I've ever playing through the Batman Telltale series and boy howdy, this is wild and underrated. One of the best Batman games I've ever played. But without further ado, let's get right into it. Toby Joker, where is she? Where is she? Purple is the best one. I think for me it would be in purple, red, blue, then yellow. Now I'm trying to go into this without any like preconceived notions of like how the Arkham series played because I don't want to think it's going to be like Arkham because I know it's not going to be like Arkham but we'll see how it goes. Hey, what are you Oh fuck, dude. I was not expecting that. Are they gonna trip the tripwire? Idiots. Rookie mistakes. Rookie mistakes. gonna show bring the whole goddamn place down. We'll be out of here before anyone can stop us. I need to turn my head. Gordon, no! Gordon. They're on the 52nd floor. I'm going in. Hey, wait! Wait for backup! No need it. Ah! Cold. I heard stories, you know. Sent three home in an ambulance. The rest in body bags. No wonder the cops want him dead. Hey, you ever seen him? Yeah, Gotham Zoo. With all the other flying animals. Yes. I feel like this is going to be a lot of QTEs. Surprise, motherfucker. You want some free bed, man? Is that Robert Pattinson? Am I tripping? The city is safe for now. But it's made you a target. And people will keep you in the crosshairs until you're shot out of the sky. I can handle it. Oh. Got in. Don't let it get out. Like it looks like a Telltale game, but I'm yet to have it feel like a Telltale game. You know? What was that? Surprise. Bye, Felicia. Honestly, Batman as a horror movie would be goaded, dude. Back to back, circle up. Darkness. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, I don't like that. Having to press shift and E at the same time. Oh, what an entrance, dude. I know you're trying to create a myth, but be careful you don't turn into a monster. Sometimes you need a monster. Come on! Come on! Come on! Oh. Fucking oh. Oh my days, dude. This is brutal. Oh god. Okay, no. What about the other guy? Didn't your mother teach you to knock? Behind you, big boy. Selena, what are you doing? Dude, I have I've locked in. Holy shit. Sorry, boys. This bat's got to fly. Well, if you want to be intimidating, you're succeeding. Thank you, Alfred. The criminals are becoming afraid of you. So are the police. Well, it's a scare time to go. Just a performance. What an epic intro, dude! Holy shit! Without a scratch. So far. That doesn't belong to you. I was wondering if we'd cross paths. I like the, the voice change. I am. Cut the shit. The law. Don't tell me that's why you do all this. Squeeze into a suit, tie on a cape. Most people dressed up like that end up in Arkham. Gotham needs a hero. Someone to hunt down people like you. So that makes me what? A villain? Sounds fun. Gotta admit it though. I mean, as long as no one's getting hurt. One day you might actually catch me. But at the same time, she's not. You know not to corner a wild animal. It's dangerous. She's not necessarily doing the right thing. He's so bulky, dude. Bring it, bat. Ugh. Dude, I'm not prepared for the shift moves. Give it the old yank, Bruce. Oh God. Batman is a, a, a believer of equal lefts and rights for men and women. Well, that's cheeky. Nice try, kitty cat. You're coming with me.
Oh god. This is intense, dude. He's so accurate with that thing, man. Why go to all that trouble for this? Shit. A myth can't be killed. You, but a man can. Our flesh and blood. Alfred, please. God damn it! I said don't shoot. No, wait. What is she gonna do with that thing? Zap! Oh shit! Save the bats! Oh my days, dude! Hello. I'm doing good, sissy. How are you? Oh god, oh god, oh god. Catch the woman! Fuck. Isn't he supposed to have a cape that turns into a glider or some shit? No, that was only in the... Oh, how rare am I? I'm, I'm ultra rare. Not sure if it was for my sake or yours. Give up. There's no way out. Give me some credit. Bye, bat. <laughs> you think you're the only person with a grappling hook, brother? Oh, she stole my grappling hook. <gasps> that bitch. That was clean. You gotta give it credit for that. Step out of the shadows. Be Bruce Wayne tonight. Yes, Alfred. So much harder fight. Don't let tombstones be your family legacy. Well then, time to save the city. <clears throat> oh. Chapter one, episode one. I wonder how many chapters there are. District attorney like myself is not used to such a ringing endorsement. Hey, hey. Even one who cut Gotham's crime rate in half. Dead for Prez? <laughs> for too long, this city has burned. Dude, he looks so much like Two Face already. Hill's authority. But I promise you, a vote for Harvey Dent is a vote to finally put your foot down. And together, we can stamp out the fire and save Like, he looks like a villain. City. He does not look like a good dude. <laughs> Only Mr. Wayne, my campaign's largest backer, could have heard that applause. He would sh Well, there he is. Fashionable and fashionably late as always. Say hi, Bruce. Hi, Bruce. Hi, Bruce. <laughs> well, I tee him up and he knocks him down. <laughs> Tell Mr. Wayne and I do business. Thank you. Thank you again, everyone, for your unwavering support. Dan's voice sounds familiar. Together. He looks we like such a meathead, God. though. Mr. Wayne, thank you for opening your house to us. Now, I know this is the biggest mansion in Gotham, but I don't think you got lost on your way here. <laughs> Where were you? I know you prefer the brooding billionaire angle. So the sooner we make nice with the donors, the sooner everyone will leave you alone. Just wanted to make an entrance. Congratulations. Test you still in school. Oh, nice. You are a pillar of this city and my campaign. Why does Bruce Wayne look like Archer? Archer? And shaking hands. No one came here tonight to see me. I want to see the Bruce Wayne. Am I right? <laughs> and I can see him just fine from here. This shouldn't be painful. It's not a kidney stone. It's only a little FaceTime with potential donors. <laughs> Your face, specifically, with a mouth that's saying, Support Harvey Dent. We're the grease, they're the wheels. And they're rolling in enough cash and votes to help make Gotham a place for families again. I'll do anything for Gotham. It's my home. It's our home. 
This will help you too, Bruce. Once I've turned this city around as mayor, you'll be a hero for funding my campaign. And all I need is a decent slogan. I'm terrible at those. It always makes me sound like a used car salesman. All right, all right, all right. How about, uh... Put, put a dent in crime. Hmm? Look at you. It's not half bad. <laughs> Dude, that's, so, that? that's so awful. Bruce, I, I love it. I said. Together, you and me, we change Gotham. A city free from crime, where children can play in the streets again. That's what I want too, Harvey, but you know how rough it is out there. We yep. have to shake things up to make that happen. Well, we can start with a few hands. Hmm? Come on. People as like bulky as Harvey shouldn't wear suits. It just doesn't look right. Who is that? Hans. Mr. Wayne, I'd like to Hans. introduce you to Bob and Regina Zellerbach. Of course I know these two. Hello, Bruce. Regina here is the chairwoman of Wayne Enterprises, and her husband voted for Mayor Hill last time. I'll admit it, Mr. Wayne. I don't know Mr. Dent from a pothole on Main Street, but I trust your family. If you believe in Dent, we believe in you. Amen to that. Whoever you support is a reflection on you. And we trust someone like you to lead this city to greatness. Well, oh, McDonald's you. got a hairline? Because we want to make remember when I had a hairline? Pepperidge Farm remembers. What's up, Stamp Not just me, not just Mr. Dent. Everyone. Right, right. Of course. Old families like ours should flock together, you know. Like birds. Amen to that. You're preaching, dear. No, it's true. The Waynes and Zellerbachs are reminders of the golden age of Gotham. Uh, this city's luster faded years ago, Mr. D. Oh! Stamps with the first 20 of the night. Let's go. That Cape Bat Freak dealing out vigilante justice like it's the wild goddamn West. Oh, Bobby, regarding golden age, seems you're getting cranky. <laughs> yeah, you tell him. You Forget tell him, lady. Being blunt, but one man can't save this city. And it's a dangerous mentality to think so. That's how you get creeps like this Batman. Well, I have to say I side with your wife on this, Mr. Zellerbach. <laughs> Even a spark of hope can light the darkness. Oh, an idealist with a bank account. He'll be broke before election day. <laughs> but I know Bruce would gladly spend every penny he has to fix this city. I don't doubt that for a moment. And don't Amen worry, to though, that. I am not doing this alone. And with Bruce's help, we're replacing the dangerously unsecure Arkham Asylum with a state-of-the-art mental health facility to help Gotham's most at-risk individuals. Nice. We'll be dedicated to Thomas and Martha Wayne in the hopes that their fate will never be repeated. After all your parents... That's really nice. City. Holy crap. Oh. To be killed in a botched robbery in some alleyway. Please it's remind me. Truly terrible. Yes, I know. I was there. Like that at such a young age, it must have been crippling. If only that uh, deranged man had gotten the right treatment, maybe. Uh, well, I don't like to think about maybes, and I'm sure you don't either. Well, thank you. I wish my parents could be here speaking with you too. And thank you, Bruce, for investing in the health of this city's Ooh, future. Oh, nice. What are you making? You have our support, Mr. Dent. Go get him. We're on our way. <laughs> Not saying I doubted you, but that went better than expected. Something I don't know. Fair. It is a night of ringing endorsements. <laughs> oh, Harvey Dent next mayor and eager to know you vicky vale not interested and reporter for the gotham gazette this is a private fundraiser miss vale no reporters allowed well you don't mind if i stay and ask a few questions do you mr wayne well you can ask me whatever you want at the press conference tomorrow tonight is strictly off the record we can talk but nothing gets written down huh? i'm okay with that i was just hoping to see what makes bruce wayne tick this is quite the social event, Mr. Wayne. Oh, come on now, it's so formal. Call me Bruce. Well, Bruce, you've been. Going What's your uh, go to Macca's order stamp? But how are you doing? 
You should enjoy your own party before all the champagne runs out. Well, I'm doing better now that you're here. Well, I'll tell you, if all these stuffed shirts weren't <laughs> around, I'd give you the private tour. Oh! Mr. Wayne, you've, you've got something on your collar. Um, is that blood? Yeah. It looks like... Oh, uh. this? No, it's nothing. It's just, uh... Cut myself shaving. What? Your butler didn't help you this time? Hey, kidding. Kidding. <laughs> Do excuse me, Master Bruce, but uh, another guest has arrived. I'm sure they'll find the bar. You may want to greet this one personally, sir. Who the fuck is that? Carmine Falcone? Is the Dent campaign soliciting votes from Gotham's biggest crime family? Falcone's never been convicted of anything except being a businessman who loves this city. Excuse us, Miss Vale. Hmm. And what kind of business do you think he's in? The one that controls enough votes to get me into City Hall. This is the necessary evil of politics, Bruce. It's in the service of a better God. Is it ours? At least hear him out before you kick him out. I don't like this, Harv. I'm trusting you. Thank you, Bruce. Seriously. You know I have to pull every string I can to get elected. Yeah, well, just make sure this one doesn't hate you. The enemy of my enemy is my friend, right? Play nice. All right, you got it. You got it. We can play nice. You know, I've been in the market for a new house. Decent walk-up, sky-high ceilings, plenty of room for my cars. I think I'll take it. Though the decor offends my eyes. Oh, man, all flash, no class. What do you mean, bro? Let's talk privately, shall we? <laughs> I like this guy. This guy's we voice is familiar, too. Before we even introduce ourselves. Yes, sir. But we'll get to that. Come on, Falcone. Thank you for welcoming me into your home. Well, to be honest, you come in unannounced. You're a respectable man, I hear. Bruce Wayne. I know who you are. The guy who's gonna sell me his house. Gentlemen, perhaps we'll all be more comfortable in the parlor. Follow me, if you will. Isn't this the guy that ordered the hit on my parents? You should know, Mr. Falcone. My analysts say we're raising triple with Mayor Hill. At... Hey, what's private audience? Oh, come on, guys. Bruce, you'll be fine out there, Harvey. I saw plenty of skirts to keep you busy for a few minutes. Have a drink. Have a talk. We talk alone, just you and me. Sorry, Harvey. Yeah, I'll uh. I'll get a drink or something. Christ. I hope that was the right decision. With all of these games, I always yeah, hope it's the right decision. Like Harvey, huh? Wants to make sure the rules are followed. Mm, sort of. But in my experience, there's the law and there's doing what's right. You understand? And I'd rather see Harvey actually help this city instead of just saying he will. Well, I would say you can uphold the law and still do what's right. To a point. Mm -hmm. No one gets remembered for staying in the middle. That's I ain't here sort of true. I about politics, Mr. Wayne. Gives me indigestion. I got enough of that as is. So, let's talk relationship. Okay. Chalk this for me. Be a pal. I can get Harvey the mayor's seat, or I can pull it out from under him. Okay, imagine this is me, and these okay. are all my friends in Gotham. Okay. The businesses, restaurants, clubs, docks, unions, politicians. I'm following. I make them all move. I want to keep everything moving if Harvey gets elected. That's why I came here tonight to your lovely home, hoping to make mm. a new friend. One who can help Mr. Dent see the light, if need be. 
Between your businesses and mine, I bet we employ half the city. Oh, I'm everyone's friend. Which means you're really no one's. Pick a lane before you have a head-on collision. Uh. You listen to me, kid. I know somewhere inside that tuxedo you understand this situation. Money gets money. The risks, the alliances, the hidden costs. Mm -hmm. Your father knew which hands to shake. Okay. And which to break. Don't you dare talk about my father. You're getting worked up over nothing. <laughs> Hell, I knew him longer than you did. People don't say no to me. Well, I'm Not saying no long. now. Master Bruce, your guests are leaving. I recommend seeing them out. You wouldn't want to be rude. Heed your butler's advice, kid. Oh, and I'm no longer interested in buying the house. The owner's a prick. And he's gonna get what's coming to him. Oh, well, you wouldn't be able to afford it anyway, brother. It's priceless, and you've only got so much money. Don't tell me that was the first episode. There's like a little Batman behind me. A little loader. Loading, loading, loading. Okay, that was just the intro. I should have brought more water down with me. It's me. I love that, dude. Oh, that Batmobile looks sick. Surely he would have a tracker in all of his gear, right? Okay. We're 50 minutes in and first episode. Sorry, we're 30 minutes in. Realm of Shadows. There is no way I could play this game on black and white. Why would you keep that? That feels like some very trauma inducing stuff. What? It's kind of crazy how, um... No, that's not what I'm trying to do. Um, it's crazy how with, uh, what's it called, uh, um, with politics that only people of a certain age can, uh, uh apply? or knock out electricity in the area. I suppose that cat woman would have preferred the latter. Interesting. The newest addition can program it to reveal trace elements in a confined space. Or other pointed weapon while pressed into the tight quarters. I should see if I can refine the edge. It could be sharper. My man. Okay. What do I... What am I... Oh, data plot. 
didn't even see that. Okay. Dude, that is sick. That did not click in properly. Seven bedrooms, two kitchens, a library, a gymnasium, a basketball court, and a movie theater. And yet I always find you here. You know shit, dude. Dark, damp cave. Um. In front of a computer. I'm more at home here than the rest of the house, you know that. Then we should build an eighth bedroom down here. Sure, I can see the headlines now. Bruce Wayne, billionaire, entrepreneur, cave dweller. <laughs> Quite an eclectic resume. Did you find out what that, um, cat woman tried to steal? Well, in the process. What are we looking at? Let me try a different angle. Oh, -ho. holograms? I'm a real life Tony Stark. What am I looking at? This is a map of the east side shoreline. Okay. But it could mean any number of things. Money, weapons, drugs, everything flows through that port. Maybe it's where Mayor Hill picks up his dry cleaning. Oh, Alfred, you're hilarious. Can't make sense of it yet. There's still plenty of files to decrypt. And in the meantime, I saved you what I could. Thanks, so. Al. Yeah, the same couldn't be said for the bar. I had to literally pry Mrs. Zeller back away. <laughs> but you'll be pleased to hear everyone has left, including Mr. Falcone. Before the game switched from billiards to cutthroat, I'd recommend leaving the fist fights to your alter ego. Bloodstains are much harder to remove from a tuxedo. Mm -hmm. I don't want anything to do with Falcone. Well, he certainly showed interest in you. Mm, it's because I'm rich. For the record, your father despised men like Falcone. Thought they ruined Gotham's stellar reputation. Well, that makes Batman two of us. Still had one. It can again, Bruce. This but dude's voice like reminds this, me of Fable. Aren't helping. Is she new to town? I've never seen her before. Mm. Hopefully, she's just a tourist. I'll check the codex. Founder. Petty larceny, burglary, new criminal on the scene, tied to several recent break ins. She's effective and doesn't leave many clues behind. Currently, the GCPD has no leads. I wish it knew more about her. Oswald Cobblepot. Oh, okay. He was a childhood friend, but he's almost a stranger to me now, just like me. His family fell apart here in Gotham. He went off to a boarding school in England, and their outpasts diverged. Interesting. Jim Gordon, Vicky Vale, Carmine Falcone, Gotham City, Arkham, Wayne Enterprises. Founders of Wayne Enterprises, Alfred Pennyworth. What a name. Harvey Dent. Hamilton Hill. to find apparently no burglaries break-ins seems to lay pretty low you could learn a thing or two from her <laughs> you can't step outside without it ending up in the news lately as bruce or batman i stay out of sight when i need to define need to uh, whenever harvey calls the guy's exhausting <laughs> uh, after the press conference tomorrow i'll mark your calendar as exhausted then Thank you, Alfred. For anyone's health. I don't mean to beat a dead argument, but... No one's gonna figure it out now. Trust me. Miss Vale noticed your injuries, so did Mr. Dent. If they put it together with the incident at the mayor's office, it would undo all the long nights and close calls we've endured to get here. True, true. The spotlight more than ever. You're right, you're right. I should have cancelled the event. I know how much pressure you're under. 
Alfred's a good dude. To add to it. It's okay. I, I know you're only looking out for me. Alfred, the voice of reason. Me, we can trade places some night. Though I'm not partial to heights. Uh, old men worry. That's all. It's our gift and our curse. Damn, dude. One more worry for the list. <sighs> Sorry, guys. I just got an email from Cyberx Gaming. They're gonna process my refund. I thought I saw Oz. It's been what? 20 years? Last time I saw him, we were in grade school. Indeed. Damn. You two were thick as thieves. Oswald, however, took that role more literally than you. Holy shit. Dishonorable discharge, illegal boxing matches, arms dealing, prison stints? That's a criminal grand slam, if I'm using the expression correctly. <laughs> Fortunately, you are. Oswald claimed he only wanted to catch up, but his behavior following his family's collapse is troubling. troubling. Indeed. He's returning now. I haven't the faintest idea. Definitely not a coincidence. About the break. This cat woman shows up around the same time Oswald comes back to town. Might not be a coincidence. Oswald's crimes, numerous they may be, are on a much smaller scale than robbing City Hall. Well, he was always trouble growing up, but it was the fun kind of trouble. Mm -hmm. You both were. <laughs> Even though you and young Master Cobblepot used to be close, I'd advise you to be cautious. Of course, Alfred. But I know you can't abandon a good mystery until it's solved. You know what they say, I'm the world's greatest detective. When you see what's become of his park, I think you will. The one that got away. Chapter 2, done and dusted. I look so weird. Still in like, dressy attire, but walking around here. Such a derelict area. I love how everything here looks like cardboard. Shit, I wanted to read that newspaper. Alright, go, go back. Oh my god. Okay. Bruce Wayne associating with Gotham's Kingpin? Armstrong? Who is Armstrong? Is there anything else I can look at while I'm here? Nope, okay. Oh. Okay, spacebar accident. Okay, oh, sorry, spacebar pauses. Uh, thank you, sir. Get yourself some nice drugs, man. Put yourself out of your misery. <laughs> or kick him while he's down. Put him out of his misery. I love that there's a burning barrel right next to a wall of leaves. Welcome back. What'd you end up getting? Maccas or? Great. Mm. There's the statue, but no eyes. Well. Mmm, bacon and cheese toasty. You ain't got no cheese, Rip. There are the turtles! Yo, Chandler, what's up, dude? How you doing? Hey. Beat it. Ah, that's no way to speak to someone. You f ugly ass motherfucker. Jesus Christ. Dude, I made, honestly, the best burgers I've ever made. Cobble Plot Park, established 27th of September. 
1927. Wait. I don't have a sprint. I don't like that. I'm doing good, man. Doing good. Had a good day today. Submitted my last modules. We'll see how they get marked. See what we do from there. Hopefully it's all good and it's just a go, go ahead, but... Wallet cash. But this goes through you. <laughs> hey, you heard it, man. The hell are you waiting for? You're making a mistake. You already made one coming here. The next one kills you. And him. You don't want to do that, bro. Us. Keep walking, all right? This don't concern you, twerp! You see, that's where you're mistaken. My old mate and I have some catching up to do. And you're oh. in the moment! Come here! I think that'll do! Thank you, sir. Shit. Stay down. Oh, fucking odds. Oh, Jesus Christ. Uh, the game's good, dude. I really enjoy it. I'd say the same about you. Whoa, that was a right little scrap, eh? Nothing kickstarts the system like a dash of adrenaline, eh? Well, thanks for the backup. I yanked you away from your bloody ivory tower, Bruce. Least I can do is make sure you don't get shanked. Oh, that's very thoughtful. Yeah, fair. Yeah, it's, been it's on special on PC. Decades. Well, it was. What? I haven't been mugged once that entire time. <laughs> uh, yeah, that wasn't why I brought you here, mate. Right now, I am trying to recognize the little Bruce I used to run around this place with. Back when it wasn't. It's like, weird to see him as the penguin after like park. Used to mean seeing Danny DeVito's the penguin and the, the at, like the comic the book and animated penguins. Penguins. Over to visit. Oh, mom and dad, they put so much. They're work like in round. Uh, this guy's like fit. Those were better days. That they were. Yeah. Thought we'd grow up to be kings. I did. Both of us. Oh, really? Okay, fair. This city chews right through people. <sighs> Mum committed to Arkham. Dad damn. Ended it yourself, he did. Oh, damn, dude. My family's fortune. There's nothing left, Bruce. I know. Alfred told me. I'm sorry to hear, man. <sighs> it's funny, huh? Same place yeah, yeah, no, I get you. My family to dust. Gave you the good life. Used to run in the same circles we did. Hobnobbing parties, round the world vacations, unlimited potential. I'm, I'm sorry, Oz. No one should have to go through that. Thanks, Bruce. But we are not the only ones suffering. Good to know you have a hey, Tess. You still care about something more than just yourself. Although, I was surprised to see Carmine Balcone at your party last night. Oh, I forget that. Yeah, right it's because it didn't work for so long. That oily... No, 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 no. I only agreed to meet him because of Harvey. Beware of any man who smiles that much, Bruce. They sure. usually hide in a forked tongue. Hello! This game is uh, Batman the Telltale series. All he needs is a little push. And. It'd be a treat to watch him at pavement. Sorry, mate. This reunion got a lot more grim than I planned. Things are gonna be on the upswing soon, no? A revolution is knocking on Gotham's door, and I'm here to let it in. Interesting. Which brings me to you, Bruce. 
You see, you throw a rock in any direction, you break a window that Wayne Enterprises his owns. As the rich and powerful go, oh, you top Gotham's list. Okay. When my revolution starts, we're gonna smash windows and cross off names all the way down. Like I said, it's not gonna be pretty. It's gonna be beautiful. I'm not your enemy, Oz. That remains to be seen. Uh, Yo, Jello. Yeah, thanks, Chetty. I've got great affection for you, Bruce. I really do. How you doing, Jello? I'm warning you. When this whole thing starts, make sure you're on the right side. And which side is the right side, Oz? Because what I'm trying to do, put my money into cleaning up Gotham, that feels like the right side to me. I'm doing great, Jello. Doing awesome, dude. Chris comes friends for a new hospital site soon. Why does he walk like that? Oh, you can't tell by the way I use my walk. I'm a woman's man. Batman, I talk. Have you started back up at uh, school yet, Jello? I can smell burning. Dude, there's been so many fires in our area recently. Nice. How's that going for you? Good, nice. Bruce, Bruce. Morning, everyone. Morning, Mr. Dent. Hey, Bruce, you mind if we swap cars? I mean, mine isn't fast and the paint's rusting off, but boy, does she have charm. <laughs> oh, we didn't bring you all out here to discuss cars, honestly. <sighs> now, we're here about Arkham Asylum. Ever since it opened its doors, Harvey's voice Arkham sounds has so been familiar. Breeding ground for the criminally insane. Its methods for rehabilitation crude. Its security lacking. And we're still those who do get out, or God forbid, escape, are even more dangerous than before they went in. Arkham Asylum is a cancer on Gotham. <clears throat> but today. With a sizable contribution That's from this man here. Sus. We break ground on Why a would Alfred art mental message me facility. like that? One that will improve the well-being of Gotham and its citizens for years to come. Now, Mr. Wayne has a few words he'd like to say. Bruce? Oh, good. Um. For those with mental health issues, there are no cuts or scrapes. Their ailments are often invisible. True. But inside, they're suffering. <sighs> you know, when I was uh, nine years old, my parents took me to see a movie about a hero in a mask. It was a hero who stood up to oppression and defended the people from injustice. Oh, whole injustice reference. No matter the cost. That night, my parents paid the ultimate cost defending me from a man. Who needed the kind of help this new facility will provide. If only we could do this for people in real life. With this facility and our next mayor, we can put a dent in crime. Today, on the anniversary of that fateful night, we dedicate Dude. this facility to Thomas and Martha Wayne and usher in a new era of healing for Gotham. Did you guys see the cameraman just then in the background? He's like, questions about the new hospital, so let's open it up. Right here, please. You first, Miss Vale. Thank you. With the opening of this new hospital, what does this mean for Arkham Asylum? What happens to the old building? I say we leave the asylum standing as a reminder that we can do better. 
This time we won't fail those who need us most. Oh, good choice of words. All right, who's up next? Oh, Mr. Wayne, uh, you there. Mr. Wayne, Julia Remark of the Tribune. My sources say you welcomed alleged mob boss Carmine Falcone into your home. You even shook his hand. Um. I don't make friends with gangsters. He was an unwelcome guest. That's all. Next question, please. Please keep your questions on topic, people. We're here about the hospital, remember? But Mr. Wayne, this morning the Globe received evidence of an offshore bank account managed by Carmine Falcone and your father, Thomas Wayne. What exactly are you implying? Transactions connected to organized crime going back years and continuing to this day. Oh, shit. The paper trail ties your family directly to the mob. <laughs> oh, Care to God. comment? <laughs> uh... I don't comment on rumors. Why don't we just stick to real journalism here? Mr. Wayne, oh, Mr. Mr. Wayne, is all your money dirty? Is the Wayne family legacy built on lies? Wait, did you know about this, Bruce? How long has your family been dealing with Falcone? Could the allegations be true? What aren't you telling us? Does the mob sign Wayne Enterprises' paychecks? Oh, shit. This press conference is over. Mr. Th Wayne, that did not go well. How long has your family been dealing with Falcone? Could the allegations be true? Did you know about this, Bruce? What aren't you telling us? I'm sorry about this, Bruce. I don't know where the hell it's coming from. Damage controls my territory. We'll talk later. Everyone, everyone, please settle down. I'll be fielding your questions. Oh, from here shit. On out. Please, let's try to keep this civilized. Please don't let Alfred be fucking Bruce, wrecked. I've been trying to reach you. The police are inside the manor. Oh, shit. Don't let him go into the basement, Alfred. Lynn. Lynn, where are you, Lynn? Hey, hey, careful. Put it back. I'm afraid we can't, Mr. Wayne. <laughs> Says who? This warrant. It's not personal. I had the boys turn the lights off, keep a low profile. I understand you're just doing your job, Lieutenant. Trying to. It's hard to be a cop. Wait, is oh, he's not commissioner yet. Battles uphill in the rain with skates on. Alfred, keep an eye on them. Make sure they only take what they have to. Of course, sir. I meant what I said about not personal. We only want files related to Wayne Enterprises. The warrant covers your place, pardon me, places of residence, and any companies you own. Who authorized this? I know you and the DA are buddy buddy, but this one came from the top. Why does this guy sound like J. Jonah Jameson and kind of look like? Mayor him? Hill signed off on this himself. <laughs> as long as he's mayor, he calls the shots. Well, Hill has a history of making his opposition disappear. Rumors <laughs> and allegations, Mr. Wayne. That's all. But if they become fact, I'll handcuff him myself, same as any other crook. I don't know how your neck ended up on Mayor Hill's shopping block, but here we Is are. that the? He gave up with Spider-Man, and now he's on to Batman, yeah. That'd be a real shame. What's up with all these animal men? ...to make a conviction stick. As mayor, I think he can finally turn things around for us. For all our sakes. Hell yeah. you've got nothing to hide. Good old Jim Gordon. Excuse me, dickhead. You just fucking broke something. Are you going to pay for it? What is this? Is it going to make me lose my shit? It's... I, I, I should definitely lose my shit at that cop. Send me to jail for this, dude. Dude, that's Bruce. Bruce. that's some trauma shit right there and he keeps the the movie tickets like that's some epic trauma who Bruce? are you who the devil are you 
I didn't mean to interrupt, but... Uh, it's... It's not a problem, really. Ah, <sighs> Bruce. First the mayor's office, now Wayne Manor? <laughs> Gotham continues its streak of break-ins. <laughs> You're really going for the record, huh? Is this Troy Listen, Baker? Bruce, a scandal surrounding a beloved family like yours captures That's the That's not Vicky Vale, attention. right? I can help you get the right kind of attention. Through my connections at the Gazette, I have all kinds of access. It is Vicky Vale. I can dig up whatever you need to fight this. I appreciate the offer, Miss Vale. It is Vicky trying Vail. to say very perspective, Jelly. Here. Instantly makes you look bad. I get it. So let me say it for you. The Gazette received this supposed evidence like every other media outlet. And it's all hearsay. Flimsy sources. There isn't a shred of hard proof. Still, allegations like this, they, they don't magically appear. Mm. Someone is going after my family. After me. I already know who it is. Obviously, the sender didn't identify themselves. It's clearly Falcone. No idea who it could be. I mean, no one's even done their due diligence on this yet. Carmine Falcone wants me to be in his pocket. He crashed Harvey's fundraiser and pretty much said, hop in. Well, maybe he thinks putting a little fear in you will make you jump. It won't. By tonight, this scandal will be broadcast to every screen in Gotham. Everyone will be talking about it. This isn't my I literally to just word, told no. Alfred no, I'm going to try and lay low. <laughs> then go on the record. Right here, right now, and stop it. You need to get out ahead of this. On the record, then. Whenever you're ready. Oh, good. Um... Whoever fabricated these lies about my family, they will get what they deserve. That's Understood. a bit aggressive. That's exactly what the people of Gotham need to hear. Little... Is that not aggressive? I'm the richest man in Gotham. I could hire someone to... Beat this, Bruce. The Waynes always come out on top. Goodbye, Miss Rail. Speaking of coming out on top, April and I watched uh, The Hunger Games, a ballad of songbirds and snakes last night. And the reason I bring that up I is because... It, but everyone smells smoke. A fire is heading this way. True. Um, has made um, of enemies, but snow says snow out. falls on top. We've done nothing lands on top or whatever. Gotham. Good movie. I really enjoyed it. Days. All this on the anniversary of your parents yeah that's a new one it's uh for free on prime harvey's the district attorney he should have told me this was coming then find out why he didn't because he's using you for your money like he's willing to be friends with falcone surely he's like a little bit loose on the back end you know what I'm... maybe Hmm. What the hell's going on? Wait, does this have to do with what the reporters were talking about this morning? You tell me. Shh, come on, keep it down. Let's avoid making another scene, shall we? The press is already up my ass as it is. Yeah, dude, I recommend it. It's a long movie, though, like nearly Mayor three hours. Will authorize this? Yeah. Then the cops raid my house, taking everything related to Wayne Enterprises. Computers, hard drives, files. Oh, son of a bitch. You're the goddamn DA, Harvey. I didn't know about this. I swear. Hill totally blindsided me on this one. God damn it. <sighs> okay, I, I believe you, Harvey. Mayor Hill's trying to screw us both over with this move. Mm -hmm. And he's made two enemies. Can my assets get frozen Why at this would time? Hill stick his neck out over this, just to tangle you up in some frivolous investigation. That just doesn't make sense. I mean, what could he possibly hope to accomplish other than a few cheap headlines? Do you think Falcone could be behind it? He didn't seem too thrilled after the fundraiser. Ah, oh, God, what a mess. Bruce, I wish I could just make this go away, but I'm not sure if I can. If I get in the way of this investigation, he would be able to spin it as a conflict of interest. And that wouldn't be good for either of us. You should probably distance yourself from me. What? No, no, I can't do that. Well, you may have to. Don't say that. You- There you are. Hey, you. Sorry, I got a habit of being late. No, no, just glad you made it. Oh, they both instantly know. You didn't tell me you were bringing a friend to dinner. 
This is Selena. I hope I'm not interrupting anything. Harvey never mentioned you before. Oh, really? That's interesting. What was your name again? Uh, it's Selena. Selena Kyle. Harvey, I'm sorry to say, there. but uh, Batman's going to bang your girl. I'm not going to fall. Oh, sorry. Selena I can't get over how much he looks uh, like uh, Archer. Gotham, introducing her to people. You're an excellent tour guide, Harv. Well, if I lose the election, I guess I can drive one of those double-decker tour buses around town. Meet anyone yeah. <laughs> Not really. They haven't all been as welcoming as Harv. Mm. I was mugged. I'm just angry I let that masked freak get away with all my stuff. I still can't believe I let you walk home alone. Well, I sure hope whatever he took wasn't too valuable. Actually, it was. It's probably long gone by now, whatever that idiot took. I hope not. These are important materials. Ooh, sensitive? Very. I don't know how I'm going to explain this to my client. When things like this happen in my line of work, people tend to overreact. So, what do you do for a living? It's complicated. High risk, high reward. Ah, stock market, huh? <laughs> Something like that. At least mm. I'm not the only one who's taken a beating. That press conference? Oof. We've got it under control. Do you? I'll handle it. Yep. Someone at my office has to know what's going on. Uh, you know what Harvey looks like? He looks like a character from Saints hey, Row. Harvey. Everyone walks like they got a pole up their ass. Why do I look like I'm gonna fall asleep? Nice to meet the real you. In case you're getting any ideas, no one would believe you. <laughs> right. This explains a lot, actually. How you can afford the fancy armor, the toys. <laughs> Wouldn't Harvey be surprised? <laughs> Not to mention everyone in this cafe. Everyone in Gotham like high. It's not the first time a man's hit me. I'm sorry to hear that. Don't worry. I'm not gonna expose you. Yet. I'm curious about something now. I do what I do for money, but you're Bruce Wayne. What's your excuse? I'm fucking I have awesome. To, but you I think you know enough already. The rest is my secret. And here I was thinking we were starting to get somewhere. How disappointing. You have I was school test. To me. I want it back. This is awkward for me. I'm used to robbing people, not the one being robbed. It must be important. What's on the drive? I don't know. You don't know what you've stolen. It's not my business That's good. to know. My clients don't know who I am, and I don't know who they are, or what they're moving. But you know who I am. These people I'm working for, they don't screw around. If I fail to deliver that drive, it's going to cost a lot more than money. Mm. Well, it looks like you've made your bed. No, we've made this bed, and I'm not going to lie in it alone. Ah, uh, that's me. Catwoman. If they don't get what they want, there will be consequences. I don't like consequences. All right, you want my help? You got it. What can I do? You can give me back the drive. <laughs> yeah, we had a punch on at the start. Listen, I don't have a lot of time. My employer is expecting me to drop it off. Where? Just give it back. The address now. No, give me the drive. No. You're just going to have to trust me. I don't do trust. I guess I'm screwed either way. My contact. He'll be expecting a cat, not a bat. When are you supposed to meet him? Well, aren't you lucky that I look good in a cat suit? Better hurry. Everything okay here? 
You tell me. I have my people working on it. We're gonna straighten everything out. I feel better already. Sorry, but I've got to run. So soon? Aren't you gonna stay for a drink? Yeah, Bruce. Stay for a drink? <laughs> I'd love to, but I've got another appointment and I really don't want to be late for it. Oh, all right then. Don't forget to change into your suit. Warehouse 133. Dude, the QTEs in this game are wild. I wish it had controller support, though. It would be much better Alfred, with controller I'm support. At the warehouse. No sign of Catwoman's contact. It's quiet. It's because you're at Warehouse 122. Uh, warehouse 22. It's supposed to be Warehouse 133, you idiot. It does? I don't know, I tried. I tried to... I don't know, it's just, it's not giving me options for controller support, I don't know why. Yeah, weird. There's a merch thing in every stream. Uh, oh my god. It's if you get it once, this you will get... Handoff. It was a massacre. You will get something. I'd have to count the pieces. That's an explosion. Have done such a thing. That's what I'm gonna find out. Gordon, Eastside Docks, Warehouse 133. That warehouse clearly said 22 on it. Jesus Christ, dude. Nothing left to bury. Oh, dude, the purple looks so good. Analyzing. Well, that's cool. Volatile chemical, potential psychoactive nerve agent, vile stuff. I don't know. Maybe. Have the computer catalog the compound for further analysis. As you wish. Oh. Cool. Items can be. Link exploded, did so with enough force to obliterate the person standing next to it. Ooh. The chemicals themselves were inert. Purple and black was the best option, yeah. It was purple, then red, then blue, then yellow, in my opinion. Jesus, we're gonna put this guy back together like a goddamn jigsaw puzzle? Same mercs that broke into City Hall. Hmm. I love how they get his brow to move. White rose. Purple and red were greater than the other calling co card. Uh, co colors. I agree. Busy as of late. Send the drones hunting. I want to know his every move. Good thinking, sir. Honestly, Alfred, one thousand IQ. Lord of face, face slashed, throat torn open. So, not natural causes then. Skylight Club. Interesting. These guys all look like zombies. It's giving me uh, Walking Dead vibes. The damage seems to originate from inside his skull. What did this? What the hell?
Oh. Sensors say it's an incendiary route. What the frick? residue. This could have superheated the contents of the canister, causing the aforementioned boom. Yes, sir. Blood, broken nails, bits of human flesh. This is how The Walking Dead starts. Break the links to reset them. All right. Oh, cool. don't think so. No, no proof. Okay, that's fine. Surely that makes sense, right? I shredded this murk to pieces, barehanded. God, brutal. What would cause someone to do that? The nerve Probably, agent yeah. Could make them psychotic. Okay, that's cool. Um, okay, we need to find something that connects this dude. Canisters were stored here. Canisters of what? Canisters of do's nuts. Dude, the purple with the eyes would be fire. It's a cop. The forest grows thinner every day. Okay. Man's is so strong, dude. What the freak? Looks like a bullet started this. A normal bullet couldn't have caused that explosion. Doesn't appear normal. The point of entry's melted. Okay. We link that with the bullet from the cop's eye. I hate that I don't have a sprint. incendiary bullet dude this makes me feel like batman like i'm i feel like a detective the bullet that killed the cop is the same type that blew up the canister i'm sure they didn't find that a little thank you for the wide face i appreciate that it appears military why am i looking up right now Okay, so we've got stuff linked. What else am I... Can I get a hint? I can't go up there. What do I... Hello? Hello! Daddy, oh, what's up, see? Okay, so good man, how are you?
Dude, imagine if I was like just walking in the blood and Okay. Scrap of metal with a melted hole in the middle. Military grade bullet designed to impact super heat. I am lost here. What am I looking for? When I come out, it... Can I... Oh. How do I... What are my controls real quick? Show selectables, okay. Was... It's not really helping now, in it. Oh, something was here when the explosion occurred. Yeah, it looks like tire tracks. Track. After the explosion. Track and truck. Yes. That's kind of cool. Th this reminds me of Detroit. Falcone leaving his rose here. This is a message. Dead cops, stolen chemicals. He's making a big move. Snipers hit a canister with an incendiary bullet, causing it to superheat and explode. This may have been a distraction or a way of destroying evidence. Mm. Cops That's really to cool. The theft. Falcone's men gunned them down. Then things turned grim. Possibly due to the psychoactive nerve agent. A cop ripped up a merc's face with his bare hands. God damn. It was put down. Same sniper, same type of bullet. Looks like same super got what they wanted and escaped. Have you located the shooter? No, but based on two impact trajectories, the canister and the dead cop, the shooter could only have a clear shot from there, there, or there, and would have contaminated himself with the phosphorus residue. Program the skimmers to pick up that signature. Right away, sir. I don't think it'll be here. I feel like here is too close. Both targets could have been shot from here, but no phosphorus trace. Also, why did he have show a sniper with an AK? Hey, we got a phosphorus trace. Phosphorus spike. Clear vantage point. We have a winner. Let's go. Should we check the other one? This is the right spot. So where did he go? Tr 
trace stops here. Then he should be nearby. Found him. Time to go to work. Honestly, the wide eyes are pretty fucking sick. The day was good. My turn. I was not prepared. Don't make me add your corpse to this graveyard. Valcone, why did he do this? I, I ain't telling you nothing. You, you can't make me talk. Talk, and I spare you an ambulance ride. The police won't offer the same. Not to a cop killer. Rather chance them than talk to a clown like you. Okay. You trying to scare a confession out of me? I won't break. Your bones will. Holy shit, dude. This is cold. Oh, I get to torture him? Oh my god, dude. what they said about you. You're a freaking animal. Time to live up to my reputation. You know you can bleed. Hello. Drop. All on the inside. Tell me the plan. Or I start swinging. I ain't scared of you, man. If you're gonna hit me... You asked for it. Tell me. Where is she? The cab woman was supposed to hand over a drive. Had the container number we needed, but she flaked. So we had to find it ourselves. Container by container. Someone must have heard us. Called the he gave that up really easy. Why risk open war with the GCPD? Some kind of chemicals. Balcone wanted them. What are the chemicals for? We were paid to steal them, not ask questions. I start here and keep breaking until you answer. Oh, dude. There's some kind of explosive. A weapon. I don't know. Balcone said he'd use him soon. Used? Where? That's all I know. I swear, I swear. I told you everything I know. You're an animal. I was just there for a pickup. I swear. You're... Oh, God. Jesus Christ. These are cops. Get an ambulance in here. I think I need to call the coroner instead. It's Montoya. Send the cleanup unit to the docks. Warehouse 133. Now put up your hands! Don't move! Batman. What did you do to him? Don't move! He confessed to everything. It's how you got it I'm worried about. You have the right to remain silent. Gordon. I said silent! If you say another word, I will shoot you. I don't care if half the city thinks you're a hero. Right now, you're a suspect. Put down the gun, detective. I'm on your side. Oh yeah? It doesn't look like it. It will when you hear what I have to say. Falcone stole a shipment of chemicals. Appears to be a weaponized <laughs> nerve agent. Causes You'd think he'd have like a recording thing in his suit, right? So he could play it back. You already have one. You're taking this too far, Bruce. This is intense. Alfred, stop trying to talk me out of it, bro. This is what I do. This is who I am. I am the bat. Like, you think he'd use it more. Of a bat, but you're not an animal. You beat that man half to death. Wrong. I hit him once, and then I threatened to break his arm, but I didn't break it. Your parents didn't raise you this way. That's true. And neither did I. He's still alive, isn't he? And in the hospital. <sighs> Next time it might be the morgue. Nah, I, I showed restraint. Preposterous attack on your family. You must show the world. How you doing, Sake? What's going on, dude? Giving everything to the city and then being murdered for it? My thoughts exactly. Every time you leave this cave.
I still got un I can't unsee Archer. Just as work, bro. Don't lose that. I don't mean to be a doddering old fool on the subject. Trust me, I won't lose my way. Why do you think I do all this, it's Alfred? Quite understandable to stray from the path now and again. So long as you can find your way back. You bury the person, Bruce, but you never bury the memory. Sometimes I wish I could. That trauma, dude. That night, that alleyway. It made me who I am. I can't get it out of my head. That is your gift and your curse. Being Batman can allow you to turn back the tide of treachery that's reached this city's shores or drown you in its sorrow. When you doubt your fate, remember why you started all this. Mm -hmm. Remember that boy in the alley. I won't forget. Neither will I. See, there's a difference between dishing out justice and just getting revenge on a bunch of petty criminals, you know what I mean? Okay. Let's just check the codec. I want to see what's been updated about uh, Catwoman. Uh, it turns out her real name's Selena Kyle. Yeah, okay. I want revenge? Yeah, fair. Okay. All right, let's see what was this is. Finally cracked. And inside, Mayor Hill was hiding more than I could have imagined. Oh, ho, ho. This is a complete mess to Carmen Falcone's criminal organization. What in the world was Hill doing with all this? Blackmail? Illegal arms dealing, drug running, hits, <laughs> money laundering. Do you see Dad's name on any of these documents? I'll run a search, but so far I don't. I feel like he was meant to say something there, but then he this didn't. It, Alfred. Days off are good, man. Jen's birthday was great yesterday. Uh, smashed out my assignments today. Got the de uh, dentist for April tomorrow. Getting Jen's ears pierced for her birthday tomorrow. Jim Gordon. He could mobilize the entire police force against Falcone. What about that reporter from the Gazette, Vicky? Yes, uh, Miss Vale. She could release this evidence through proper channels. I suppose it comes down to who you want to help most. Or who you think could do the most good. Oh. Oh, that's interesting. We get to choose who... Oh, oh, oh. Obviously we go Gordon, right? We want to take Falcone down. Like, surely we go Gordon, take Falcone down, and then Vicky Vale gets her, her story anyway, but... You know, he can protect himself, right? Maybe not. What, you reckon go Vicky Vale? But that's because you're a simp, dude. You just want to try and chop in. Totally Gordon? Yeah, see, Jello's on my side. <laughs> no, I, I think we go Gordon because... Is this what gets Gordon the commissioner? Go for the MILF? Bruh, I don't even know if she has kids. She can't be a MILF if she doesn't have kids. Mm. I'm gonna go Gordon. Cops are on the front lines of this war. Gordon needs this more than anyone. A wise decision, sir. We'll attack Falcone on two fronts tonight. Gordon through the police. And Batman by any means necessary. A... Whatever Falcone is planning, it ends tonight. He's a spider, Bruce. Eyes everywhere. A dense web of goons poised to trap you. No one has ever managed to bring him down. I haven't tried yet. Yes! 
dude, that was cold. So is this what this whole thing is about? Trying to take down Falcone? Does Jim know that I'm Batman yet? This, this is a silver bullet. And it's gonna put Falcone down once and for all. I don't even want to know where you got this. No, you don't. Still, I gotta know why. Have you played this, Jello? Why give this to me? Don't get me wrong. I appreciate the hell out of this. Everyone on the force will too. I heard you were the last honest man on the force. No need to blow smoke. Shit. I got enough cancer coming my way as it is. But thank you. Honestly. You don't remember? This evidence can lock up Falcone. Nah, that's so good. <laughs> I'll sleep like a goddamn baby. For once. You know, as much as I appreciate you calling me here, I gotta make one thing crystal. I can't be bought. So you should know this isn't going to change a Fair. thing about the investigation of your family. Ah, I don't expect this. supported to. the Gotham police. There are no strings attached. I just want Falcone gone. You and me both. Oh, uh, yeah. I'm tired of staring at his mugshot. His cigarette looks like a Nerf bullet. straight from a crime scene haven't been home yet jesus sometimes i think this whole city's a crime scene we're just walking through it look at the sadness in what his eye holding? nerf's new toy yeah. much safer thanks bruce well lieutenant hey stick to jim hey jimbo pew, pew. Good old Jimbo Gordon. Smoking simulator? Ah. Well, I can always change in the car. The Skyline Club. We pulled a, a, a matchbox off that dude. Hey, yo? Imagine if he pulled out just as someone came and like he just smashed them. Oh yeah guys, I almost got hit on the way home from work on uh, Tuesday. Lady, I shit you not, she was like less than 10 centimeters, centimeters, less than 10 centimeters away from my car. I don't know if she's like falling asleep or something. Like I went to merge because I didn't see her. I'm all right. Like I didn't see in my side mirror. But then obviously, you know, you go to check after you check your side mirror and she was in my blind spot and then I witnessed her like swerving into me and then boom, pulling back. Good point of entry. Aha, uh -huh, okay. <laughs> Tell me another. What's the difference between the Mafia and City Council? I don't know. Aren't they the same thing? That's Only right. One of them is organized. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> You're cute. Gross. So, uh, you alone? Not anymore, I'm not. <laughs> that is gross, dude. Surveillance. You'll be detected as soon as you enter. No time for subtlety. Where's Nikki? In lockup. Again? Christ, Kimmy. What did they pinch him for now? Some hit down at the docks. Nikki? No. I didn't think he was a hatchet man. You and me. What a weird thing to say after a joke. Yeah, dude. Make your rounds. 
Yeah, no broken bones. Still healing from the last time, I bet. Mm, all it took was a couple of C notes this time. Nice and easy. Nice and easy, my ass. I know it burns powder night. The whole city can smell it. Interesting. What powder are they referencing? The white rose. Falcone's symbol. Of course. Red rose after tonight. Oh! Dude, who knew Batman was like cold with nothing it? Here. Of course, nothing here. Why would there be something everywhere? Okay. Is that for the building. Gotta be Falcone's hideout. Surely. Four armed guards. Stealth not an option. I'll put together a plan of attack. Stand by. Since we're taking this guy down. Jesus Christ, dude. Okay. Let's go. Very solidly constructed. Nice. This is sick. This reminds me, you know that one scene in, um, you know that one scene in, 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 uh, Sherlock Holmes? Well, that cut, those couple of scenes in Sherlock Holmes where, um, he, like, like, premeditates exactly what he's gonna do? This is exactly what it feels like I'm doing. Ah! <laughs> Whee! Is that everyone? And then it's this guy. This one might be tricky. Any ideas? I've got it covered out. Death from above. How did I know? Surprise, motherfucker. That guy looks like a mob, like, member of the mob. What? Oh, I still gotta do QTEs. Holy shit. Oh my god, dude. Holy shit! I am the Batman! Bro, that was fucking sick! Nice, dude. Batman doesn't kill, meanwhile, Batman. Batman just maims. He's a maimer. Oh, shit. Falcone's ne uh, voice sounds familiar as well. Surprise, motherfucker. Ooh. How about this one? That's not a very secure door. Take 
What up, bitch? Dude, the interrogation tactics in this game? Oh, fuck. Fucking A, dude, that was sick. You've lost Falcone. I can get a few more rounds. Hey, <laughs> dude, this is sick. Oh. Still want to play games? We're all being played here, including you. Those chemicals just so riled up about. They're mine, all right? Okay. But someone is trying to cut me out of the deal because I did not make that mess at the docks. And who did? No, oh, with that. Gotham's watching now. I don't want to I don't I didn't want to like maim them while maim him while I was being recorded Oh shit. Yeah, see? Why didn't I have that before? See, this is what I was remembering from the Robert Pattinson movie about how Falcone. Not Falcone. Was it Falcone? Yeah, Falcone was talking about how he was working with his dad. A high-rise mafia hangout in downtown Gotham was the arena for a clash between the notorious Batman and alleged mob boss Carmine Falcone. Who was that movie was so good, dude. I fucking love that. Drop. That's ben honestly that on deal. par with The Dark Knight. The crime boss getting his is well overdue. Falcone has slipped through the law's grasp for years, but after this dramatic arrest, Bro, you should watch it. Evidence released by the GCP you'd, I think you'd like Gordon, it, Sick. Falcone's going away for a long, long time. And speaking of newly uncovered criminal dealings, this brings me to the story everyone is talking about. The Wayne family. Why does that guy sound like Nicholas Cage? W on the Wayne Enterprises Tower was a reassuring sight. You knew that there was something pure at the heart of Gotham. And this city its faults was built by good people but with thomas and martha's shining reputation called into question we no longer have such assurances and even worse it seems the apple hasn't fallen far from the tree gotham's greatest son bruce wayne seen here shaking hands with carmine Fuck. falcone i knew just as crooked as his parents in his defense wayne fired back saying 
Whoever fabricated these lies about my family, they will get what they deserve. Understood? In a world where the Waynes, our golden family, are corrupt, who are we left with? Who can Gothamites look up to? He looks like Nicolas Cage and sounds like him. Only time will tell. I knew I shouldn't have shaken his hand. Well left, Daddy Batman. The suit, the car, this entire cave. Master Bruce? Everything I built. I created all of this because I didn't want any more innocent people to die. If Falcone's telling the truth about my parents, then what the hell did we do this for? Bruce, Come on, Alfred. What have you been hiding from me? Oh, shit. Alfred! Holy crap. What an intense start to a series. Oh, my God. I was not expecting it to be so damn brutal. What a great game. This is easily shaping up to be one of my favorite games of all time. I <laughs> Just after one episode. If you like this video, hit like. If you don't like it, dislike it. Subscribe, comment down below. Join the Discord. It's linked in the bio. Check me out live on Twitch and TikTok, which are also linked in the bio. And until next time, stay humble, stay hydrated, stay healthy. Tell someone that you love them. I love you guys. And I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.